Hey guys, Ajax22 here, and I uh, wanted to do a quick update on the Diesel Punk uh, AR-15. Um, not a whole lot to report. I ordered the pistol grip and the triangular wooden handguards from uh, Ironwood Designs. I actually ordered it about a month ago, and it's still not here, so I'm going to have to go uh, whine a little bit. But uh, they did, you know, it's the whole artists take their time with the, with the wood thing. Uh, but I did confirm that I ordered it and paid for it and all, so just a, a matter of a wait and then. Um, one part I did manage to source is a aluminum butt plate for the A2. Um, G Wax Armory makes these. Uh, they're a little, they're thinner. Uh, you have to trim the spacer for them to fit, which is why this isn't on here yet. Um, they're actually designed for uh, their their alternate style stocks but uh, they do work I put one on um, the shotgun I was working on that has the A2 AR-15 um, stock on it and it worked okay I uh, still have to strip the anodizing off and I probably want to get rid of the uh, G-Wax uh, engraving just because I'm not a huge fan of having names on stuff uh, it's not what I want, ultimately. Uh, what I really want is an exact A2 buttstock with the trapdoor, just in aluminum. I know they exist. They have to exist. There has to be, like, one of them somewhere. I swear I've seen one before. I think I have one on one of my rifles that is buried away, and I have to dig up. Um, yeah. I know I've seen it. Anyway, that's uh, that's not a lot, but uh, yeah, getting there one little bit at a time. Sorry I don't have more for you guys. I uh, wish the wood was here. I'd love to mock it up and, and see it. Uh, I did get a hold of a Thompson barrel so that I can copy the finning onto a blank. Uh, one thing I've been looking at is definitely mid-length uh, gas tube seems to be the, or mid-length mid gas system seems to be the, the happy point. And then I'll do a... Um, just a, a reduced, um, I guess it would be custom. It'll be a little bit higher and a little bit, um, and shaved down under the front hand guard. Uh, and I'll run a cut down Colt LMG gas tube. I actually sourced one of those. Uh, it's not here. It's at my buddy's shop. I need to go and hassle him about that. But, uh, it, uh, it exists, so I should be able to get it all done. Um, but yeah, from, that that sort of eliminates the uh, the issue of the uh, of the gas block, the, the the trim down but extended upward gas block should get rid of the bend in the tube, um, clear the fins just fine, and then we'll just run a conventional, uh, you know, A1 front sight base, an early one. Um, I'll have to do a little research. I think they had one that had uh, casting lines in it or something that was the very, very first generation. Um, but yeah, coming along a little bit at a time. I'm getting there. All right, um, that's, that's what I got on this. Have a good one.